What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So today is going to be episode 2 of the Chosen series. Hope you guys enjoyed the first one. If you haven't seen it, there'll be a card somewhere around here letting you guys know about that first episode. Like I mentioned in the last one, we are going to be watching the whole episodes of The Chosen, the whole series of season 1, because season 2 is going to be a week from tomorrow. Tomorrow is Sunday, Palm Sunday, and so in a week's time will be, of course, Easter Sunday. And so they are releasing Season 2, Episode 1 on that day. So I'm pretty excited. Um, again, I mentioned in the first episode, but I have watched... This is my third time seeing this show. It's a great show. If you haven't seen it, watch it. It's great. By no means, I'm saying we are, you know, a certain religion on this channel or anything like that. It's just a great show to watch. And it's, you know, the time right now. It's the last week of Lent and all that kind of stuff. Easter is coming, so uh, I think it's a great time to kind of get into watching this show and, re and kind of refresh my memory, especially because season two is coming out. So I'm really excited. So without further ado, let's get into it. Jew tax collector and his escort demand to see the Praetor of Judea. It's urgent, they say. Did you hire a man to spy on Jewish merchant vessels fishing on Shabbat to avoid taxation? Yes. Simon. Is he in your district? He is. His debts are forgiven. Surprise. As well as those of his brother? His... Yes. Forgiven. Goodbye. Thank you for your time, Praetor. I do not find Simon reliable. Once he was deficient in his taxes, and when I pursued remedy, I discovered that he had spent an inordinate amount on games of chance at the local establishment. Additionally, based on his financial status, I questioned Simon's connections to the merchant class. All right, around for the table. You all need this to have a good time. What is this about? Oh, well, I can celebrate my brothers and sisters. So, so, make sure Amos gets a side, though. He can't handle the good stuff. <laughs> to buy a Jason, you'll need this to drown your sorrows after you lose this game. And <laughs> you, I don't know your name. You're new, but wow, well, huh? We're not afraid you'll steal our fish. We're afraid you'll steal our women. Look at this man. Like Absalom, no? Only <laughs> 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 better than Absalom. Stay away from low-hanging branches, my boy. <laughs> <laughs> Stay away from Steve's staircases, old man. That's it, Sol? None for Jason? Oh, what did he do this time? Ask her wife. <laughs> I was given the impression there was a matter of some urgency. We are considering a formal inquiry. What are the charges? A miracle, Rabbi of Rabbis. This man's testimony is clear. His account, miraculous. The woman in the Red Quarter to whom you offered rights, she is redeemed. You... you saw her? There can be no doubt. Teacher, you were successful. I told Silence. You. This is an unparalleled revelation. Are you the Messiah? Yes! Do you want to lose that ugly nose of yours? It's you. It's real. I am Mary. I was born Mary. But you were called Lilith, yes? Please, I must go. No, no, please, Mary. I, I am desperate for your help, Mary. 
I'm a, I'm a Pharisee. I'm visiting from Jerusalem. I'm a man of God. And I believe you have experienced a miracle, Mary. It wasn't anything you did. It was someone else. Some one else? He called me Mary. He said, I am his. I am redeemed. And it was so? Who did this? I don't know his name. I don't know why I am sharing this with you. I... I don't understand it myself. But here is what I can tell you. I was one way. And now I am completely different. And the thing that happened in between was him. So yes, I will know him for the rest of my life. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, it's getting good, man, it's getting good.